Hi, I'm Tim Shaw. I'm a biomedical technician at Queensland Health. What I do here is I'm responsible for servicing and maintaining a medical equipment and I'm also responsible for attending call-outs in the hospital, addressing issues, anything from replacing a network cable to helping set up and configure patient monitoring systems. One of the things I love about work is the satisfaction you get from sending a repaired piece of equipment back out into the hospital. Quite often I'm dealing with something I haven't looked at before. They're complex pieces of equipment, so it is a good feeling when you come across an issue and you're able to fix it and uh, send it back out and it's good to go again. The first reason I chose University of Queensland was because of its reputation, especially with the engineering faculty, and also the staff are very supportive and they always make themselves available. I initially only chose electrical engineering out of interest. It was about halfway through my degree that I added the biomedical side to it. And that came around because I actually um, went into hospital and this was the first time that I'd come across equipment that is actually responsible for, you know, keeping people alive and, and keeping people well. So I was quite curious about, about how it worked. As soon as I got back to uni, I immediately applied to add biomedical as a second major and it was quite easy to do. Uh, there's a couple extra subjects that I had to complete, but it was definitely worth it, I think. So I think it's important for students to know that studying something like electrical engineering or civil or mechanical, you're not just tied into those traditional sorts of engineering roles. And further to that, there are actually quite a number of you know, new and emerging engineering fields. Biomedical is one of them, um, and they're growing rapidly. So I would suggest students look into those options as well, and don't just assume that it's always going to be just your classic engineering jobs, like working for a power system or you know working for a construction firm. There's so much more out there. Electrical and biomedical engineering in particular, I think, unlocks a lot of pathways. You can step into the biomedical side, which is a bit more specialised, but it is an emerging field, so it's very exciting to be a part of. And also there is still the electrical side, which is huge. That can involve anything, and you can find yourself working in just about any company, I would say. Yeah.